Come up here to the front, those that are participating in the baby dedication. We'd like you to make it here toward the front. All those that are participating. We know we got more than this, so babies, make your way here with your parents, our grandparents, our both. Amen. What a great time it is in our service for baby dedication. It's always a glorious time to, to reflect and see what God has blessed. I wanted to make this note too. I didn't make it the welcome. Uh, Rebecca's sister from Africa that we support and love uh, is back with us. So we praise the Lord. She's back safely from Africa. So we, we praise the Lord for that and his goodness there. But as uh, we had this time of baby dedication, uh, we make it a time that it's more so not just a dedication of the babies, it's a dedication of the baby's parents because you have such an influence in their life being dedicated to the Lord. First of all, the influence of them coming to the Lord one day and then also serving the Lord one day. And so that's a great honor, but it's a great privilege that you have to be able to make that kind of input in their life. And yes, you grandparents have an input as well. You're their parents' parents. So you really got the input, amen? So all of you are here because you want to be, uh, have your child dedicated because they are on loan because one day they'll be on their own, but you have this time that they are dedicated that you can make all the difference that you can make in their lives. So we, uh, we want to have this time that you can make that dedication publicly here at this baby dedication. It's also my honor to have my own little niece over here to be able to dedicate as well. So it's my honor to do all these. And what we'd like to do now, we've got some uh, Bibles that we would like to, to give out to those. We do have a requirement for uh, this to be um, official dedication. The baby has to have five verses memorized <laughs> by the end of this week. Okay, so work diligently or we'll have to cancel the uh, official dedication. So let us uh, all bow our head and let's have a word of prayer for these who have standing here, and I'll just lay hands on these as we make our way around. Father, in the name of Jesus, Father, we dedicate these children to you, Father God, in the name of Jesus. Father God, they are really yours, but God, on loan to us. And God, as I lay hands on, on these precious babies, Father God, in the name of Jesus, may they one day grow up, Father God, and serve you. Father, you command of their parents is to bring them up in the nurture and the admonition of the Lord. That means to train them and instruct them in your ways. And Father God, we lift them up that they will grow up to come to know you. And not only know you, but to serve you and be great servants to pass on the torch of the Christian faith to these young people who will pass it on to others. And Father God, we just lift them up, lift their parents up, that they'll see the example in them and lift up their grandparents, that they'll be the example as well, that they'll look to them and say, I want to be just like them because they're just like Jesus. So Father, we commit this group to you, Lord, right now. And may the impact of what is felt here will make impact in our world, in our churches, in the lives of each and every person here. In Jesus' precious name. And everybody said, amen, amen. amen. Y'all may be seated. Praise the Lord. Let's give these a big hand clap. And as we continue on in the service, let's stand up as a group and let's continue to worship the Lord this morning. <laughs> 